Shalom. All praise is due to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Racha Kwadash. Double honor to the elect apostle, all those are great, most known every well. Shalom to like Ak out there, doing this work in sincerity and truth and not for vain glory in season, out of season. I just want to bring a quick uh, show uh, about being an Israelite 24 hours a day. Okay. You know, um, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, the elect of you. Okay. You know, you found out that you're Israelite and you know, it's truth. Um, you know, so uh, we have to be an Israelite 24 hours a day. Okay. You know, not just in front of the apostles, uh, bishops, elders. Okay. But 24 hours a day. Okay. You know, because it's truth is uh, uh, rivers of living water. You know, it's 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 constantly moving. You know, it's not stagnant. Okay, all right. You know, so we got to put the work in, man. You know, we got to conduct ourselves as Israelites twenty five hours a day. You know, according to the spirit. Okay, all right. Of course, you know, we have to rehearse the righteous acts, you know, which are the law, statutes, and commandments. Okay, so I just want to go to it right quick. Uh, this is Philippians 2 and 12. Okay. Wherefore, my beloved, as ye have always obeyed, not as in my presence only, you know, you know, you're around the apostles, bishops, the elders, you know, you know, you're a super duper Israelite, you know, but then, you know, when you're not around the, the, the presence of the apostles, bishops and elders, you know, and then you're back to the man of the world. OK, you know, so, you know, we got to get them shows in, you know, you know, and, you know, we got to uh, study, pray. You know, and I'm talking about myself double, you know, and um, be an Israelite 25 hours a day, man. Have faith, you know, have faith in Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, in the time of Jacob's trouble. You know, we <laughs> we still have to be an Israelite, man. You know, we can't lose faith. Abaratazah, you know what I'm saying? You know, if your head is under a guillotine, Abaratazah, we can't lose faith. You know, you know, with the um, game changer, okay, uh, with the MOTB, you know, Abaratazah, Yahawah Bahashem, Yahawah Shai, doesn't have us lose faith, you know, you know, we still got to be Yashar Allah, the sons of the power, Yashar Allah, okay, Yahi, Shah, Prince. Allah, power, Yasha Allah, sons of the power, man. Okay, sons of the Most High. So we still have to be the sons of the Most High, man. You know, you know, so um, that's what it is. Wherefore, my beloved, as ye have always obeyed, not as in my presence only, but now much more in my absence. Yeah, that's right, man. That's right. You know, leave from camp, and now all of a sudden, you know, be back in the world again. You know, you're supposed to be obeying Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, what he said to do 24 hours. Okay. Work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Yeah, man, that's being an Israelite 24 hours a day, man. You know, praying, putting up the shows, you know, studying. To show yourself approved, you know. So, hey man, you know, being um, being on fire, you know, to come out the camp, man, you know, like the apostle Taha always says, you know, it going out the camp sh sh shouldn't be a burden unto you, you know. You're supposed to be you're supposed to be salivating for it, you know. I mean, it's cold, but <laughs> the scriptures say in season and out of season. We're in out of season right now, you know. We're still supposed to be on fire to go out to camp, do the shows, pray, study, 
you know. And that goes double for me. Okay, I'm speaking to myself double. Okay. Work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Yeah, man. That's right. Fear of Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Okay. Um, go to one more scripture. No, two more. Let me go to Second Timothy four and five. Second Timothy four and five. Yeah, man. Second Timothy four and five. Be an Israelite twenty four hours a day. Second Timothy four and five. But watch thou in all things, endure afflictions. Uh, man, that, that's a part of being an Israelite 24 hours a day, man. Watching in all things and enduring afflictions. You know, because of, we have to endure the afflictions, man. You know, that come upon the men of the Lord. Because you know the hopeful elect. Okay? And the men of the Lord. You know, because you know, man, Satan is going to be out there. You know, you know we're going to catch hell, man. And especially these days coming in now, you know, with the uh, game changer and the MOTV. You know, we got to endure those afflictions. You know, it says. Do the work of an evangelist. Make full proof of thy ministry. And that's why you see the Apostle Taha, Apostle Kabar, Apostle Rakal, Apostle Ramla, bishops, elders. You know, they push for brothers to do this, do these shows throughout the week. You know, to come out to camp. So that, you know, in and in, in, in out of season. I mean, this is this one thing to go to camp in in season. What about going to camp and out of season? Okay. You know, you know, we've been called snow dummies, you know, uh, all kind of names for going out and, you know, in the snow and in the cold. OK. All right. What does scripture say? Uh, he would not uh, plow, but by reason of the cold, I'm saying, saying it verbatim. OK. <clears throat> you know. That's right, man. Making full proof of our ministry. Getting these shows done. Okay. Uh, one more scripture. Uh, Luke 18 and 7. Book of Luke. Luke 18 and 7. Eighteen and seven. Oh, uh, let me see. Yeah, so that Luke eighteen and seven. Um, Luke eighteen and seven. Okay. It says, and shall not Yahweh. Avenge his own elect. That's right. He's going to avenge his elect. The hopeful elect. The elect men. Okay. And of this truth. All right. His elect that, that's going to be saved. You know. Out of the uh, time of Jacob's struggle. From the uh, game changer. From the MOTB. Okay. He's going to avenge his own elect. He's going to avenge his own elect on who? On the so-called white man, Esau, and the other heathen nations. And shall not Yahweh, Yahweh avenge his own elect, which cry day and night unto him, though he bear long with them? I tell you that he will avenge them speedily. Nevertheless, when the Son of Man cometh, Son of Man is talking about Yahweh Shai. Shall he find faith on the earth? That's another part of being an Israelite. 
24 hours a day, having faith. Yeah, brothers, having faith. A few sisters, having faith. You know, you gotta have faith, man. And Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Okay? In our daily lives. Even though, you know, <laughs> I mean, this is not what you would call living. Yeah, man, we we slaves in here in this world that, that Esau has rulership over, you know, but daily, you know, and uh, when the time of Jacob's trouble comes, when the famine comes, a famine of the word, when the famine of the food, okay, when the Gurkha troops come, when the concentrations come, camps come, you know, when the, when the concentration camps come, you know, when the MOTB is fully implemented, you know, we gotta have faith, man. And Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Okay, that's right. So when Yahweh Shai comes back, shall he find faith in the earth? Faith is a major part of this truth. Okay, so I hope you've been edified, and with that, Shalom.